I'm sorry I swore at you. I was just upset. I didn't know you swore at me. This is the Mike Zimmer we have come to know. Are you gonna intense? Are you gonna score? Well, you got three penalties on that drive. Oh, me! Combustible. We work together as a team, we fight. An old school tough. We bust our ass off, right? But here in Northern Kentucky, you see a different side of Mike Zimmer because this is his happy place, Zimmer Ridge Ranch. Yeah, it really is my happy place. 176 acres of Kentucky Hills, where Mike Zimmer goes from the pressure cooker of being an NFL coach. Joe, you want a hot dog? The head chef and grill master. I'm a pretty quiet person, but when my daughters say, if you want to get him to talk, just talk about the ranch. Most NFL coaches have a lawn service. When Mike Zimmer goes to the ranch. Get to go out and get on the tractor and mess around. He's hands on, and when he's done mowing. Talk to daddy. Talk to daddy. It's fish on. Talk to daddy. Fishing just a few steps from your house from Mike Zimmer, it doesn't get any better than that. First cast. I'm not I'm not that good. I just do it for fun. And I'm too impatient. Brian Robinson's a big fisher, right? Yeah, that's what he said. Even though it's fishing and not football. I have to send him that clip of me catching that bass. <laughs> Once a coach, always a coach. Kind of like this, Joe. You just kind of lift it up. I just had a bite, but he didn't take it. Mike bought this property when he was coaching the Bengals. It's about 30 minutes from Cincinnati. Actually closed on, I believe, like in August or September. Got the job with the Vikings in January. And then I said, you know, it, the place is so beautiful. I said, I'm just going to keep it. And last season, he had this magnificent home built on the property. And while he helped design it, Mike left the details up to his realtor and builder. I told him, don't bother me during the season. Don't, I don't want to know about where to put a, an outlet or anything like that. Just do it. I said, when I get here, I want the furniture. I want the silverware. I want glasses, the whole bit done. And, and they did. And um, it turned out amazing. Woo! My man! <laughs> He has his own skeet shooting range. Oh, shit. You may notice that he's shooting left-handed because his vision isn't good enough to shoot right-handed. This is actually kind of fun, you know, because it's a different challenge. It's like challenge. doing it all over again. Yeah, it's like a different challenge. Not as challenging as it was to have eight surgeries on his eye during the football season. I was never afraid of losing the eye. There was times that I thought it was going to go, and I thought, well, if it does, it does. Which leads Zimmer to a sensitive area. The perception that he was a bad patient and went against doctors' orders while dealing with serious eye issues. I'm bad at a lot of things, but I, I, I really wasn't bad patient. You know, if he told me go lay flat, lay face down for 24 hours, I did. He said, you know, I don't want you looking up. You, as long as you're looking, you know, a horizon below, it's fine. You can watch all the tape you want. You can watch your iPad. And that's what I did. When we shot the story, um, yeah. Zimmer still had a gas bubble on his eye. It has since dissolved, and doctors tell Zimmer that the prognosis is good. You know, he said you could have uh, LASIK or you could have a contact put in, and I said, I think I'm done with surgeries, Doc. <laughs> Enough of those. Uh... I'm done with that. When he tools around his property, he always wears sunglasses or goggles to protect the eye. Do you think football here at all? Yeah, but. It's not like constant, you know, a little bit. Sometimes it's just uh, not even thinking football at all. And then sometimes, you know, I'll be out riding a quad and it'll be, oh, you know what we should do is, you know, let's think about doing this and I'll write a little note to myself. Zimmer Ridge Ranch is a retreat, a comfortable hunting and fishing lodge, a man cave that anybody who loves the outdoors would cherish. But there's something missing here. She'd be amazed at the place. Mike's wife, Vicki, died unexpectedly in 2009. We put a little tr you know, tree out there that her favorite color was purple. So it's a flowering purple tree that is really, it's really pretty. Did you think about that at all when you got named coach of the Vikings? That Vicki's favorite color was purple? Um, yeah, you know, my daughter said, you know, her, we spell her name V-I-K-K-I. You know, so it's V-I-K for Vikings and purple and, you know, so maybe it was just, you know, maybe she had something to do with it. Zimmer Ridge Ranch is in the bluegrass state of Kentucky. Let's go to work! I would say if we were out in the street, we probably would have had a fight. Run over it! Run over it! But purple. I love adversity, baby! Will always be his favorite color in Minnesota and at his happy place.